take a look at some of the best NBA storylines that I found across the internet. Starting with Steve Kerr's doppelganger. Have you seen this shit? Dude is looking like a high school chemistry teacher who gets sturdy with the basketball team. And he pulls up to a Warrior game like nobody's gonna notice. Are you serious? On the Pat Bev podcast, him and Roan were talking about the top five least white, white NBA players. And number five, Garrison Matthews of the Hawks, simply probably because he's all tatted up. Number four, Dante DiVincenzo, who brought some culture to his high school, let's not forget. And now in New York, he's a sniper. Number three, Alex Caruso. Alex Caruso is special. He always has carried himself with a certain level of swagger. Number two, Chet Holmgren. Lanky doofus, but definitely got some swag about him. And number one, Tyler Hero. I feel like he's universally known as the white dude who's really not that white. After yet another big game by SGA in the Thunder, his post-game interview, they asked him, what exactly is it about him that makes him so consistent? And the brother said, my whole life is consistent. SGA is special, but him saying my whole life is consistent? That's a bar. 